Okay. Stokely Stormrider 95. So this is an old standby. It's, well, not old, it's not old. The Stormrider 95 is a ski that's always been a benchmark in regards to on piste, you know, front side, a little bit of, uh, just a little bit of, of off piste action, um, solid. It's a weighty ski. It's it requires skill. It's not a ski you get on if you're not a great skier. I mean, the the idea behind this ski is, well, I'm a good skier. I want to elevate my game, control more than anything. That's what I want. There's a reason this ski costs what it costs, and there's a reason they make it by hand. It's unbelievable. So it's got a little heft to it, and if you're a good, competent skier, it makes beautiful arcs and is not affected by the terrain at all so if you want a ski that will just simply flatten out terrain if you want a ski that'll put you in charge of what's going on i mean this is the thing but easy to ski on is it easy mm -hmm. and it's quick it's stable you gain more confidence on this ski pushing it or letting up whether it's a short turn long radius turn on the pitch going for a long GS, trying to find some snow, it cuts through and handles it with confidence. Think high-end Mercedes Benz, um, but we're talking about uh, um, trajectory. We're talking about lots of um, um, stability and a ski that really holds the ground. This is a ski that really rewards good technique. This is a ski that's firmly planted to the ground. And if you want stability and control, this is your ride. I've never skied on a ski like this before. It's worth the money. There's a reason they make it by hand to give you that great performance.